Alright, what up, what up, everybody? This is your motherfucking scene crazy, so... <laughs> yeah, I just got back from recording some new tracks that I got um, saved. I'm gonna be uploading those here um, within the week, so... Yeah, I'll be having more music for y'all. Um, also, another thing, too. Um, I just realized, I've been on YouTube for a long time. I've been on YouTube for probably about... Eh, probably around... Uh, oh, at least over six or seven years, maybe even more. Um, but yeah, and on YouTube, there's a lot of interesting videos. There's a lot of interesting videos. Um, some of them might be tutorial videos. Um, Today, I'm going to show you how to go from this to this within the first hour of playing Minecraft. So when you've spawned in, one of the first things you want to do is check your surroundings. Now our first goal is actually to get wood. Luckily for us, there's a tree over here, so I'm going to head over here and get some wood. So I'm just going to break the wood with my fists, and just keep going until you've got five or six logs. Then sometimes you have types of videos like this. This is private property! What are you doing? Do you realize this is the princess of Norway? Do you think I care? Stop harassing me! I'm but yeah, anyway, um, there was two very interesting videos that I kind of want to cover. Um, I don't want to give them any exposure for what they truly are, but it's going to tie into what I have at the very end of this video, planned for the end of this video. So yeah, let's get into it. Let's fucking, let's put our temple hats on. Let's get this. Um, yeah, let's do this. Let's get ready. Let's get ready for some absolute fucking cringe. <laughs> Let's get ready for some cringe, shall we? Oh god, this is gonna... I only want to do this video, but I'm doing it for y'all anyway, because, uh, yeah. More content, more views, you guys know what that is. Alright, so I was scrolling through YouTube. Now, I'm not on the YouTube platform, because like I said, I don't want to give these people any more, uh... I don't want to give them any more views than they've already gotten on these videos, so I'm not giving them any... I'm not even gonna link this video or anything, so I'm not even gonna do that i'm not gonna allow them to get views on this video off of my video um but yeah anyway so this is just me kind of just sitting here um giving my giving my open honest reactions my own opinion um which i will do at the very end of this video but yeah we got one more after this and then we'll and then i'll end the video and this will all tie into my video um once you know you guys will you guys will know once it once it uh all ties in together because this video is going to tie in with the other one and the whole video and then and in and, 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 and an entirety if i could even fucking speak today um but yeah fucking a dude um but yeah these two lovely gentlemen right here have apparently roasted me and i'm using quotation marks because yeah roasting me apparently roasting me in a video a six minute video <laughs> I had to download this on on, on, on a VLC and uh, yeah I'm gonna be reacting to this just this one time and I'm not doing this again um, because yeah some people like me actually have brain cells that they do want to preserve um, well into their 50s and their and their 60s and shit. So I mean it is what it is So anyway, I can I can afford to lose a couple a couple little bit of brain cells But I'll get those back pretty easy. So, you know, it is what it is. Um, but yeah <laughs> Let's react to this foolery. Here we go What the, what do these guys got for me? <laughs> what, what, what what did these guys have for me for in store for uh, roasting me and by roasting I mean Roasting me. <laughs> Let's see what they got. Let's see what they got. All right. If it, and I'm just I'm just gonna say this right now too. If you guys out there, the, the viewer the viewers that are watching this video, if you guys even want to roast me or anything, you better come with it. You better not go soft. You better not go soft on the jokes. You better hit them where it fucking hurts. Um, because yeah, if there's gonna be a roast of me on online. Obviously put some fucking effort into it Obviously Just so I put that out there, but let's get back into this. Oh my god, dude This is gonna be cringe. I can already tell <laughs> oh, Let's put our cringe. Let's put our let's put our cringe goggles on. Let's get this Surprise, motherfucker What it do, what it do, what it do. Right, welcome to the roast Oh, Quinn Quinn Jay -Z. Jay -Z. He's a bitch 
<clears throat> Let me start this off by saying if uh, you want to be a true spitter, you better learn to rap, not swallow. <laughs> All right. You know what? Straight that. You know, straight up. You know? Right. Right. <laughs> First of all, what are you doing with that paper? What the fuck? Are these people complete fucking morons? And I'm asking as one human, one normal human being to another. Are these people mentally fucking deranged? I'll let the video answer for that. I'll let the video answer for that. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Just the way they started it off is already cringe. <sighs> let the cringe let the cringe fast fucking go, I guess. <laughs> oh god, dude. Surprise, motherfucker. What it do, what it do, what it do. Right. Welcome to the roast. Oh Quick Quirk Jay Z He's a bitch. <laughs> let me start this off by saying if uh you wanna be a true spitter, you better learn to rap, not swallow. <laughs> Alright. You know what? Straight that. You know straight up, you know? Right, right. <laughs> Why was Sing Why was Sing crazy so out of breath after his rap battle? Hmm, I don't know where to mean why. Because he was overlapping his vocals so much that he forgot to take a breath. Oh, hey. I... <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <sighs> that that makes no fucking sense, dude. It makes no sense, dude. I'm not laughing at their jokes. I'm laughing at them because of how fucking stupid they sound on here. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> Run that back again. Oh my god. And why and what is he doing with that paper and 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 the fucking marker, dude? That's what I want to know. Um why has he got a marker? And I think I think that's a dry erase, erase marker. I believe that's what it is. Um, yeah, he's got a little piece of paper and a dry erase marker. So obviously it might be a script or something. I don't know. I don't fucking know. But let's get back into this lovely roast by them. <laughs> I can't even keep a straight face in this video. But let's get back into it though. Oh god, <laughs> this is total cringe. I told you guys this was cringe, and yeah. <laughs> Fucking A, dude. Oh, hey. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's run that back. Hold on. A little bit further back. Let's get it. Why was Sing, why was Sing crazy so out of breath after his rap battle? Hmm, I don't know where to mean why. Because he was overlapping his vocals so much that he forgot to take a breath. Oh, hey. <laughs> What the fuck? <sighs> How does Sing Crazy's rap battle end so quickly? Why? <sighs> Where am I? Okay. He was overlapping his vocals so much that he ran out of words. <laughs> Accidentally did yours, my bad. <laughs> that makes no sense. They literally just made the same joke twice. <laughs> so they're saying that I ran out of breath in a rap battle because I ran out of breath. And overlap my vocals, which obviously that's not true. Um, then the other one, they're saying that uh, actually I forgot what the fuck they were saying. <laughs> I forgot what they were saying because it's it's stupid anyway. I'm not I'm not even trying to break it down, but dude, that was not even that was not even a joke. Like those those two don't even count as a joke. Because, yeah, they're the same joke, and both of them make no sense. And I'm just saying this from a normal human being to another human being, obviously. <laughs> but, yeah, that was not that was not even worth even putting in there. So you kind of wasted your time on that one. <laughs> you wasted your time on, the, on, on that one. Um, you, yeah, you, you wasted your time on that one, Brody. You did. <laughs> Let's get back into it, though. Where am I, six? You six. What did Sing Crazy do to make sure that he would win his rap battle? He overlapped his vocals so much that no one else could get a word in. Oh. <laughs> that one made no sense either. So, all you're going to do for 
fucking how long is the video? Six minutes. Are you, you're just gonna put out jokes about me overlapping my vocals? One, I don't even do that, so makes no sense. Three, it, you know, two, um, it doesn't. Yeah, it just don't make sense in general. Like, I mean, I can't say I can't say it even more any more simpler than that. Fucking these people are literally fucking morons, I believe. And I'm just saying that just from what I'm watching and what I'm hearing right now. These people are just mental fucking morons. They actually think that's a fucking joke. You're gonna have to take a fucking comedian class or something because... I mean, you ain't the class clown here. You ain't the class clown here. I'm just saying that right now. <laughs> fucking A, dude. I'm, you know, like I said at the very beginning of this video, if you're gonna fucking roast me on something... At least come with some fucking content that actually makes sense. Not some fucking bullshit that you thought up because you're, you know, in a meth-induced fucking uh, high or whatever the fuck. Like, that's what this is. That's what this is to me. But let's get back into it. Oh, God. This is going to be fucking cringe, dude. <laughs> I told you guys this was going to be cringe. I told you guys straight from the jump it was going to be cringe. And we're already one minute in this, and it's already fucking cringe. Dude, I just want to get this over with. I really do. Ugh, it's hurting my brain. It's hurting my brain, dude. It is hurting my motherfucking brain. Like the way, the way that the idiot, the idiot, the can't fucking speak. <laughs> the fucking idiocy of this whole video is through the fucking roof, dude. It is. I don't even know if that's a word or not, but I'm gonna use it anyway. Cause why the fuck not? <laughs> anyway, let's get back into it though. <sighs> okay, eleven. How does the crazy kid get the girl of his dreams? How does he get the girl of his dreams, man? He mumble rapped until she said yes. <laughs> <laughs> that made no sense. <laughs> These people must have been dropped on their heads when they were born. I mean. That was not even a funny enough joke, like, at all. I mean, yeah, I'm laughing at them, but I'm not laughing at the fucking joke. Because <laughs> that was not even, that was not even a joke to even be made. <laughs> like, I got a girl because I mumble rap? <laughs> Obviously, they don't listen to my music. Obviously, they don't. Maybe they do, I don't know. Um... But I don't mumble in my shit. I don't. <laughs> so you must be talking about someone else. So hey, it is what it is. Maybe there is another. Maybe there is another me out there talking about. I don't know. Um, but let's get back into it. <laughs> but yeah, let's get back into this. Uh, you mumble rap, bastard. Let's see. We'll go. We'll go to fourteen. How do you think Crazy's fans react to his mumble rap? They couldn't make out a single word. Well, bam. <laughs> Actually, that is incorrect. Most of my fans can understand my music, so... That one... <laughs> so, yeah, you're just gonna say that, uh... You're gonna say that I overlap my lyrics. You're gonna say that fucking... What else did you say? Uh... You're gonna say I overlap my lyrics. You're gonna say that I mumble rap. Is that all you guys have against me? When none of that is even fucking true. <laughs> These guys are just laughable at this point. I'm laughing at them, not the jokes. Just thought I would put that out there. <laughs> but yeah. Fucking A, dude. I want to get this over with. I want to get this over with. So I'm going to shut up now. Let's get back into it, though. What did Sing Crazy do to make his rap stand out? He started mumbling even more incoherently than before. <laughs> Same fucking joke again. See, these guys don't even have a creative talent uh, when it comes to jokes. Because, yeah, they're using the same exact fucking punchline over and over again. Oh, you're just using mumble rap to get the girl. Oh, you're just using mumble rap to do this. Oh, you're just using mumble rap to do this. I mean, that is too repetitive. That is too repetitive of a joke. Which literally takes the meaning of the joke they're trying to set up. And it makes it to where it doesn't even fucking work anymore. <laughs> I should know this because I used to I used to joke around. I used to be the class clown and shit. So I know what the fuck I'm talking about when it comes to this shit. So, yeah. 
you're you're not that great at trying to be a comedian. So yeah, don't try too hard. Don't do don't try too hard to be a comedian when you're not a comedian. Cause yeah, you're gonna end up stepping on your own toes just like this person is. <laughs> it's a great example of why you should not be a comedian. This video right here is it a great example of why both of you should never be comedians. And yeah. It is what it is. Let's get back into this, so. Oh. Uh, how does Team Crazy become a household name? How does he become a household name? His mumble rap earned him the nickname the un incoherent one. That made no sense. <laughs> that one made no sense either. So, you use the same joke four times. Four times. God, these are, these guys are fucking idiots. <laughs> Incoherent. Hey, at least at least people can understand my fucking music. <laughs> they can't even understand what the fuck you be saying on the fucking mic, cause you be you be you be doing shit like this. <laughs> like nobody wants to hear that fucking shit. <laughs> if I'm being honest, nobody wants to hear that shit. But anyway, um, yeah. What do, what do I know about roasting though? What do I know about roasting? <laughs> Let's get back into this though. Oh, yeah, coherent one. He went there. Damn right, I went there, my <laughs> What did Sing Crazy's mom say when she saw his crooked teeth? What the hell are those? Nope. We should have known better than to mix the family tree. <laughs> and resorting to the mom jokes. People have literally said a lot of those mom jokes to me in my lifetime that they actually have no effect on me, so... Yeah, you're just, at this point, you're just pulling jokes out of your ass to try to justify something. It's not going to work, buddy. It's not going to work. <laughs> but let, let's go, let's go. Okay, you go. You guys want to roast me? All right, all right, let's get back into this. <laughs> let's, see, let's see what other ammo you got towards me that is better than the first fucking shit that you said. And we're only like two minutes into this, so yeah, I got another fucking... Got another five minutes of this shit. Actually, four minutes of this shit. So, I want to get this over with. I want to get this over with because this is fucking. This is hurting my brain. <laughs> this is hurting my brain cells and every single fiber in my body by just sitting here <laughs> watching this shit. Cause, cause I know they're idiots and I know that they don't understand comedy like they like they should. Um, like they claim they do. They claim they understand comedy, but I don't see the content here. I see a lot of made up stuff. Um, this is literally what a fucking five-year-old would do. These are jokes that five-year-olds would come up with. Um, yeah. So, it, it's not intelligent. It's not intelligent. Um, if I were to roast somebody, I'd probably either make them mad or make them fucking cry until, until they fucking, you know. I'll probably make them cry their eyes out. Yeah, because I can get pre I could get pretty brutal with my roast. Just know that. <laughs> but then again... Who do I know about, like, like, then what do I know about Rose? <laughs> like, who, who am I that knows about Rose? <laughs> um, but let's get back into this, though. Uh, <laughs> what does the crazy family tree look like? Just a, a branch. Uh, just a bunch of branches crossed over each other. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> Now trying to do the family branch thing. Okay, that joke's been made hundreds of times too, so... <sighs> fucking hate you. These people do not know how to set up their jokes or their punchlines. It's sad, really. <laughs> it's sad, really. To be the parents of these two people that are like this, that think like this, that are fucking... They're probably on drugs, who knows? Who knows, dude? Um... Then again, I can't really tell um, who's on drugs and who's not because, uh, yeah, I don't really have the, uh, I really don't have the identification, you know, for that. So, yeah, and and some people say that you can look in their eyes and see if they're doing drugs, and I don't know, though. I don't know, though. That first guy right there, the one wearing the mask, he does have a little bit of a glistening going on with the eyes, and some people say that if your eyes start glistening or something, that usually means either they're on drugs or they're intoxicated with alcohol. And I should know this um, because I did have some family members that drank. 
Um, rest in peace to all, the, all of them that did end up dying from that um, RIP. But, yeah. I mean, yeah, I know, the, I know a little bit of the signs, but, yeah, this guy's probably on drugs. I'm just saying that right now. I'm just going to put that out there, but let's get back into it. This is it right? We live and learn. How do some crazy families celebrate the holidays? How do they celebrate the holidays, man? Well, that's a family reunion, of course. <laughs> oh, that one didn't make sense. Family reunion? That's... Yeah, these people literally don't even have brains. That's why I don't take drugs. That's why I don't take drugs, kids. That's why I don't take drugs. This shit right here. You end up fucked up like this. I mean, yeah, drugs are bad. Drugs are bad. <laughs> I'm gonna sound like this is out part guy. <laughs> drugs are bad, um, okay? <laughs> I think that's how he says it. <laughs> Fucking South Park, though. South Park is goaded, but... Let's get back into this. I'm gonna shut up now. Save my best for last. Save the best for last. Are you guys ready? I don't think you're ready. Do you think they're ready? What I mean, I don't. I don't, I don't think they're ready. Like straight up, you know. But hey, man. Did you hear about Sid Crazy's mom dying in a car crash? <laughs> no, I did not. Yeah, she was in the wrong lane when she heard one of these mumble rap songs. <laughs> That made no sense either. Okay. Okay. So you got exploiting my mom's actual death for your joke, which makes no sense. Okay. Okay. I mean, it, it's not the first time I've heard a joke like this before, so... I mean, I've heard worse. But that wasn't even a... That wasn't even a real joke anyway. <laughs> Yeah, these people, like I said, they don't know how to they don't know how to put together a, a fucking joke even if it were to save them lives. So I mean it is what it is. Let's get back into it though. What? Wait, did I already do that? Which one? Okay, alright. Why does Sing Crazy's mom die in a car crash? Why? She was so busy trying to decipher's mumble rap that she didn't see the other car coming. <laughs> There, there they go again, duplicating the same joke again. Now, this is why these these type of people shouldn't even be comedians. Like, if you if you can only come up with the same joke and repeat it again, you shouldn't even be a fucking comedian. I'm just saying that right now. Um, and I've watched hundreds of different comedians. I've watched Kevin Hart. I've watched fucking uh, uh what's the other comedian? Uh, Dave Chappelle. Um, the list goes on. I could name more. Uh, fucking who else? Who else? Um, I'm talking about people that have done stand-up comedies. Um, Chris Rock, obviously. Chris Rock is the goat. Um, don't give a fuck what people say. Um, but yeah, Chris Rock. Um, there, there's a couple more. I know there's a few more that I'm missing, but those are the main ones that I watch. And uh, obviously, Keen Peel. Um, they, you know, Key and Peele, they, they, they have some hilarious skits too, but, yeah, mostly Dave Chappelle, um, Kevin Hart, and, uh, what the fuck was the other person? Fuck. <laughs> it is what it is, but yeah, um, yeah, and even if, and, 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 yeah, if you ask any of these comedians I just named, they would all say, they would all sit here and they'd probably laugh their asses off watching these, uh, watching these incoherent people try to come up with shit to roast me with to roast me with because yeah this is apparently a roast <laughs> this is supposed to be my roast they're not doing a really good job of it <laughs> we're only like three minutes in it so we're about we're about halfway done oh god <laughs> i'm gonna shut up for the rest of these ones but i will pause it when i have some shit to say so obviously but <sighs> Make this fucking end, dude. <laughs> I'm so glad I'm not queen crazy. I know it. That was just a little roast. Yo, Ted. You already just asked. There you go. <clears throat> Bitch. Tell me which one. Seven? I need nine. Nine? He is nine. Right there. Why did seem wait. Why did seem crazy never get a girlfriend? Why? He was too busy playing robot video game porn to make it. 
to ever make a move. Oh, shit. <laughs> that makes sense. <laughs> that made no sense, dude. I couldn't even understand. He just he just read the fucking paper. He's like he's like this. He's like this. He's like. Blah, 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 blah. I mean, are you that fucking stupid? Did your mom actually drop you on your fucking head when you were born? <laughs> Cause I could not understand that. I want to run that back. I want to run that back. Cause that that was <laughs> that was the only funny part of this whole video. Him grabbing the paper like this, obviously, and then going. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> yeah, these people don't even know how to set up fucking jokes. <laughs> you need a, you need you need to learn from the from the greatest comedians on on planet Earth before you actually start doing actual comedy. Just thought I'd put that out there. <laughs> he was too busy playing robot video game porn to make to ever make a move. Oh, shit. <laughs> that makes sense. <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll cross it out for you. Yeah, that guy cannot even fucking speak, dude. <laughs> it is what it is, though. Let's get back into this fucking cringe, dude. I, I just want this to end. <laughs> I'm only doing it for y'all's entertainment. Just, just to let you guys know. Um, I wouldn't have done this otherwise, but I'm just doing this for entertainment purposes. And uh, yeah, you guys will see at the very end of the video, like I said, um, why I'm doing this. So. Yeah, let's get let's get back into this. I want to finish this, so we got like we're only four minutes into this. So let's 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 finish the last two minutes of this, and then I'm I'm done with this one. And then we'll do, and then we'll move on to the other video too, because we got one more video after this. So yeah, got to get through these. Got to hit them at the ballpark. <clears throat> Shit, <It's> <laughs> Shit. <laughs> we see what you watch. We know you watch, boy. You do the seven. Why did Seem Crazy become known as a true spitter? Why? He was so bad at rapping that he had to offer oral favors to get recognition. Shit, oh. you fucking good. <laughs> that one made no sense either. And why every time that other guy speaks, I cannot even hear what he's saying half the time. Dude. Speak your fucking words. And if you if you gotta say some shit, say it with your motherfucking chest, dude. Like, you're just sitting here going... Bleh, 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 bleh. That's all I fucking hear. I can't make out the rest of the fucking words, dude. Like, if anyone's the incoherent one, it's you. It's you. Like, learn to fucking speak, dude. Go to... Go back to fucking kindergarten. Go back to fucking preschool. And learn how to actually fucking speak. <laughs> oh. Trust me, dude. If I started roasting people, a lot of people would be pissed off or they'll be crying in the fucking corner. I'm just saying that right now. Like, you don't want that side of me. You know, you do not want that side of me because, yeah, I can make a lot of people mad. I can make a lot of people fucking, you know, I can make people sad. So, you know, if you want to go that far, we can go that far. <laughs> But yeah, this right here, this is like fuck. This is like some fucking amateur wannabe comedian shit. So, yeah, that's what it is. I'm calling it out for what it is, though. But let's get back into this. I I want this. I want this to get over with. Cause yeah, these people don't even know how to set up punchlines, and that one guy does not know how to fucking speak, dude. <laughs> he does not know how to fucking speak. <laughs> but yeah, let's get back into this fucking cringe. Oh my god, dude. Oh, let's finish this fucking cringe. I right, do it. <laughs> oh man, this one's good. Hey. How did Seem Crazy get famous? How? He sucked too many dicks that he became the most popular rapper in town. <laughs> <laughs> that makes sense. That actually does not make sense. You wanna know why it don't make sense? Because they are all created off of nothing. This is a bag of nothingness. You are pulling jokes out of your ass. Pulling jokes out of your ass. And then reading it off of a paper. Like this. And then being like... Duh, 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 duh. Duh, 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 duh. He mumbles. Duh, 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 duh. He's a little... He overlaps the lyrics. Duh, 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 duh. 
He, 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 he does this. His mom died from... That's all I fucking hear. Either say your fucking words or go back to fucking preschool and relearn your ABCs and all your other shit. Because, yeah, if you can't speak that good, then you got to go back to school, homeboy. You got to go back to school, homeboy. You got you to gotta relearn that shit. <laughs> I mean, come on, dude. You guys are like fucking how old? How old are you guys, actually? That's my question. I'm, tw I'm 21, almost about to be 22. And you guys are acting like fucking five-year-olds on this shit. It's fucking pathetic, dude. Alright, Ted. What did Sing Crazy do when he got... When he got rejected? What? He had to mumble rap his way out of it. Shit. That makes sense. <laughs> no, that's the fifth time they've done that joke. And I've counted. That's the fifth time they've done that same exact joke. Oh, I fucking mumble rap. Fuck out of here, dude. If I mumble rap, then why does everyone that listens to my music say they can hear every single lyric and every single syllable that I fucking spit on every fucking song that I've ever done? Like, like I said, this is a literal nothing sandwich, a nothing burger, um, that has just been, yeah, like I said, they're just pulling it out of their asses and reading it off of, off of paper. That's why they got that paper that looks like something like this, and they're just reading it off. You guys don't know how to set up jokes. And I'm not taking that back, because that's facts. <laughs> you guys do not, how, do not know how to fucking... You guys don't even know how, com uh, how, how comedy works anyway. And I don't even know how comedy works that well. Yet I still know how to set up punchlines way better than half the people that are my age. So, yeah. That should, that should speak volumes. And these guys are even probably, probably even older than me, if I'm speculating. Maybe, I don't know. Um, but yeah, these guys are literally older than me and they don't even know how to set up comedy or like any, any, any type of jokes really. <laughs> so yeah, like I said, I'm just laughing at them. I'm not laughing at the jokes. There's a difference. Um, but yeah, they're, they're, they don't even, <laughs> they don't even stick. Like I said, nothing, nothing burger. So it is what it is. Let's get back into it. We only got like five minutes. Yeah. We got like a minute of this shit. So let's get back into it. Might as well. Ah, oh, the fucking cringe, dude. At least I mentally prepared myself before this, so that's good. You do that with everything? <laughs> would seem crazy, man. You gotta know he does get shit. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean, why should I be surprised, right? Who can't get past him? Twelve. How does Sing Crazy come up with his rap name? How does he come up with his rap name, Dad? He couldn't think of anything better, so we just mumbled it. <laughs> Oh. Nah, that's not how I came up with my name. <laughs> that is not like, dude, these jokes make no sense. <laughs> Every joke gets dumber and dumber and dumber. At least the first joke was kind of like, it wasn't, it wasn't great, but at least it's better than the shit that I've already started to hear. Like the first joke was like, yeah, yeah, it was, it was, it was I. Right, but these next jokes just keep getting dumber and dumber and dumber and dumber and dumber. <laughs> like I said, these people literally don't even know how to make comedy. They're using recycled stuff from their previous jokes to try to justify that, which is not working in their favor. <laughs> I love it though. I love it though, cause these people are literally making themselves look like idiots, and I'm looking like the smart one right now. So, and yeah, I am the smart one because if you guys can only think up, think up of that, and think up of a, a nothing burger to throw at me, then it's not really a roast. So yeah, this is just two idiots going online and saying some dumb shit. Just say some dumb shit. <laughs> it's like it would be like me posting a video saying, "Hi, I am seeing crazy." I love to eat cheeseburgers, and I work at Carl's Jr. That's all. They're, that's all they're trying to do. They're trying to make fucking videos like that. So, yeah, <laughs> fucking a, dude. Hey, at least I'm smarter than them, you know, IQ wise. So that's good. I'll let you do thirteen. Thirteen. What did Seem Crazy do to try to get his rap career back on track? 
What did he do? He tried to mumble rap even faster, but just made it harder to understand. Fine. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, six times you've used that joke. <sighs> nothing original. Like I said, enough, another nothing burger, so it is what it is. <laughs> Trust me, these guys don't want me to roast them because I, I I would make them literally not even want to go on the internet anymore. <laughs> but I'm not though. I'm not though because I'm not that petty enough to do it. So I'm just gonna let I'm just gonna let them keep this video up and and uh, expose themselves for the idiots they truly are. <laughs> so yeah, I mean you're doing a good job at, at at one thing. You're you're doing a good job at getting people to laugh at you, but not at your jokes. <laughs> if that makes any sense, that should. For the people that are normal like me. So, anyway, let's get back into it. Oh, things just went there. 18. What did Sim Crazy's dentist say when they saw his crooked teeth? What did he say? Did you just try to wrap your way out of this? <laughs> <laughs> fucking troll shit. <laughs> fucking devil. So, yeah. Another joke about what? Dude. Yeah. <laughs> That one was kind of meh. I mean, I, okay, you want to roast my teeth the way it looks and everything? Hey, at least I don't got fucking wooden teeth. Like this masked up motherfucker right here. <laughs> I can at least say that. <laughs> hey, at least I don't got fucking wooden teeth. So, yeah. Think about that one. Work teeth. Makes sense. And we'll do the last one. And number 19. What did Seem Crazy's dentist say when he saw his teeth? It looks like <laughs> it looks like you've been mumbling your way through my five. Okay, another joke about mumbling. That's seven times they've literally used the same joke and recycled it. Come on, dude. If you're going to roast me, at least switch it up with the content. Like, don't use the same fucking shit. Oh, you just mumble. You just mumble. I've heard that fucking more times in this video than I've heard in any other fucking video. Like, come on, dude. This is sad. This is sad, really. This is sad. <laughs> fucking growing up, grown ass people acting like five year olds. At least, I, at least I'm more mature for my age. So, yeah. <laughs> be it fucking I even though I'd be like 21 I'd really be acting like a fucking uh you know 25 year old or something so yeah I mean I act a lot older than I really am so that's that that must be a gift that must be a blessing from God himself maybe um but yeah at least at least I'm not like this at least I'm not a, acting like a fucking five-year-old and trying to uh pull comedy out of my ass like these people are so yeah <laughs> Oh god, let's get through the rest of this fucking cringe, dude. This is fucking cringe. Oh my god, dude. Well, that's all the way. We've done it. We roasted this bitch ass. If you want more, like the video, subscribe, hug, and not eat again. That was terrible. <laughs> that was terrible, dude. Alright, I'm gonna roll. I'm gonna roll through the next video. So, yeah. I'll see you guys when I do the next video because we got one more to go through. Um, yeah, this one's not going to be as cringeworthy as this one, but I want to just go through it. But yeah, just just goes to show that not everybody can be a comedian. Not everybody is sported out to be a comedian. So yeah, I mean, hey, if you got the talent to be a comedian, be a comedian. If you don't got the talent and you're just pulling jokes out of your ass on a fucking piece of paper with a, with a dry erase marker, then you probably shouldn't even be a comedian. Just thought I would give that advice out there. Um... But yeah, these two people, um, no direction in life. They both probably got dropped in their heads when they were born. So yeah, I just pray that they find their way. Um, and hopefully hopefully they are able to turn their lives around instead of sitting online roasting me um, over, over nothing because they want to make up a nothing burger to roast me about. So yeah, hopefully, hopefully, hopefully God helps them out. Um, I'll be praying for them, so it is what it is. Anyway, um, yeah, next video, next video. Let's get, it, let's roll it, let's roll it, let's get into it. <sighs> we got this guy again, <laughs> dude. 
I swear, when will these people actually decide to leave me alone and actually pursue something productive in their lives? Like, that's my only question. Um, but yeah, let's get back in. Let's get into this. Let's get into this. This is only like a three minute video, so let's let's run down it. Um, but yeah, let's 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 see what let's see what this person's got to say. Um, but yeah, I, it's probably gonna be some more shit. Probably I don't know. Um, but yeah, let's get it. Let's get into it. What's up, everybody? You already know who I am. <laughs> I need to make any introduction or anything like that. I'm like some people, but. No, I've just been chilling. Got into a car accident recently and kind of, yeah. I'm doing good, though. I just got this thing right here. They had to do some surgery there. but Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah, I was in a car accident, too, by the way. Just thought I'd throw it out there. Um, I, I was in a head-on collision car crash with my great-grandfather. And it was about, I think it was 2021. Somewhere around there, 2020, 2021, um, 2021-ish, so, yeah, I was in a car crash, I survived without barely, barely a scratch, the only thing, the only thing that happened was I had a fucking piece of glass stuck in my foot, I had to get that shit out, hurt like a motherfucker, but, um, yeah, that's crazy though, that's crazy though, that he got into a fucking car crash like that, but, I mean, I, I, I kind of feel that way, though. I kind of feel that way. I'm pretty sure a lot of other people feel that way, too. Um, but not everybody can survive a car crash. That's the thing about it, too. That's why I made a fucking... Uh, I think it was either an album or an EP or something. I don't remember. Because um, I got a lot of fucking music out, so... I can't really keep track of everything that I do. But, yeah, I did make a project surrounding that. And I forgot what it was called. I think it was, like... What the fuck was it called? Oh, yeah, it's called Self-Destruct. That's right. That's right. Um, yeah, it's called Self-Destruct. It's a pretty good album. And I kind of was talking about it and touching on it in one of the songs in that project. So, yeah. For those that for those that want to know more about it, um, go go listen to that album. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. It's, be it's one, of my be one of my best ones, I'd say. Um, Self-Destruct is definitely one of my best albums probably i don't know if it was an album or maybe it was an ep or something i don't remember but yeah like i said i got a lot of music i can't really keep up with everything that i drop so i mean it is what it is so yeah because my brain my brain be working a lot faster than most people so i mean hey you know it is what it is i can't stop that that's just a gift from god so let's get back into this though I recently and kind of yeah <laughs> i'm doing good though i just got this thing right here they had to do some surgery there but or not, it ain't nothing. Uh, run from the cops going 130 miles an hour in a vehicle. Still ain't stopped me. You know, I'm um, still... I'm... Running from the cops at 130 miles per hour. Why on earth would you do that? Why on earth would you do that? Dude. I mean, I get it. I get it if, like, uh... You don't want to deal with them, but still, though, trying to run from them is not going to result in anything but you getting your ass hurt. And you got your ass hurt by doing something completely idiotic there. So, yeah, I mean, yeah, it sucks they got into a car accident, but you were being idiotic about it because you're running from the cops. And that's one thing you don't do. Like, if they pull you over, you do everything that cop tells you, like, you know. Uh, step out of the car, you know, uh, put your hands out like this or whatever, or, you know, uh, yeah, all the protocols. You follow every single fucking letter to the book that they tell you to do when they pull you over and everything. You don't run from them because if you run from them, you will get killed. It's facts because they will think they will automatically think that you are a criminal and that you're trying to do something wrong, even though you're not. And then, yeah. So, not a good idea to run from them. Because that raises their suspicion of you from here all the way to here. I should know this because I've had family members that have done the same shit too. And it didn't end well for them. So, yeah. Just thought I'd put that out there. Just thought I'd put that out there. Give my, give my analysis on that. But, yeah. Probably not a good idea for, to run from the cops at you know, a hundred, a hundred, whatever. I think it said 130 miles per hour. That's, 
Dude, that's that's insane, dude. Obviously, you're gonna get your ass fucking killed by doing that shit. That that was some dumb ass shit. <laughs> hey, at least at least I don't do that. At least I don't do that. Hell, I don't even got a car anyway. But yeah, probably not gonna get a car for a minute, cause yeah, because of that accident I was in with my fucking great grandfather. But hey, it is what it is, you know. Um, R.I.P. Though. So let's get back into it. I was going 130 miles an hour in a vehicle. And another thing, why are you so fucking proud of it, dude? Like you're you're sitting there like, yeah, I, I just ran over the I, I I just I just ran from the cops at 130 miles per hour. You're all saying it like you like you're proud of it. Like what the fuck, dude? Yeah. These people must have got must have got dropped on their heads as a kid, probably. Um because yeah, the yeah, normal people don't think like this. Normal people do not think like this. Oh, I'm just gonna run for the cops at 130 miles per hour. No. No, people, normal people don't think about that. Normal people will stop and do everything the, the officer tells them. And then, you know, and then they get their ticket or whatever, and then they leave. That's usually how it goes down. But this, it, this person wants to be an idiot. So I don't know why they haven't revoked his license. I honestly don't know if they did or not. Maybe they did. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, somebody that's running that fast on like a highway or something or whatever i don't know i don't know if it was a highway or a freeway but going that fast obviously they're gonna have a reason to pull you over dude try to hurt yourself there by doing something completely idiotic <laughs> but it is what it is still ain't stop me you know i'm still i'm still here regardless of what whatever anybody else says you know i've been listening and uh, a certain somebody keeps popping up at the jaws and stuff saying something's going to happen. I'm like, whatever happens, happens, man. That's all I got to say. I'm prepared for this shit. I'm always prepared. And everyone's always saying BB gun, BB gun. I'm always prepared for shit. This is an actual gun. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Flashing a gun on a video. Where have I seen this before? Oh yeah, that's right. Everywhere. Because it's now a trend. For people to flash their guns all over the place. On Instagram. Uh, what other platforms are there? Like, uh, Yeah, YouTube. I've seen it on YouTube. Um, but yeah, you're basically promoting that culture of, oh, oh, look, I'm going to flash my gun on, on camera. I'm going to flash my gun on camera. Like, dude, this is going to completely ruin your life. If, if anybody gets a hold of this video, they can, <laughs> you are literally incriminating yourself right now by pulling out a gun saying, oh, I'm going to shoot whoever. That is literally incriminating yourself. <laughs> Dude. Why are why is this new generation so stupid that they want to pull out a gun and flash it around all over the place thinking that they thinking that they're hot shit even though they're not. And then and then yeah, and then, and, then, and then they end up doing a crime or something and then and then that gets pulled up as soon as they get as soon as they get arrested and everything and then you know, they get put in the fucking slammer for you know, couple couple years probably. Um, if and I'm not and me personally, I'm not a cop or anything, but yeah. If anybody got a hold of this video, you'd probably you you you'll probably be saying at least two years in prison at least for carrying a weapon like this and for being mentally unstable. Cause yeah, I can I can see you're mentally unstable in this video. Um, I don't know what you're on, but dude. Gotta get off them motherfucking drugs, dude. You gotta get off them motherfucking drugs. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. I'm And I'm saying that because I'm a person that doesn't do drugs. I've never done drugs in my life. I never will do any of that shit. I don't fucking go out and pop pills or do any of that fucking ecstasy and all this other bullshit that these other fucking people do and these other rappers do. I don't do that shit. I don't do that shit. Because I don't need drugs in my life to enhance my life. I don't need that shit. I can do... I can go without drugs for the rest of my life and be just fine and some of these people can't though 
Some of these people have been on drugs since they were fucking toddlers. And it's sad as fuck. It's sad as fuck that they were introduced to all this drug and gang violence at a fucking young age. And now they are growing like this and they're all fucked up mentally. And I pray this person gets help. I pray this person gets the help that they need because they need it really bad. So, yeah, I'll be praying for you. I'll be praying for you because this this right here is going to get you... Yeah, this 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 video right here is going to incriminate yourself. Um, if it falls into the wrong hands, it will. So, yeah. <laughs> Just thought I'd put that out there. Actual clip. So, I'm always prepared for some shit. So, if anybody wants to talk shit, do shit, whatever, etc., etc., I don't give a fuck. I honestly don't give a motherfuck. Because I'm prepared for shit. Ryan, I don't know if you prepared for anything or not, but I can guarantee you one thing. I'm not going down there to fucking whatever the hell your little eagle point organ bullshit is. I'm not going down there, okay? And have I said... Uh... <laughs> Dude. I called them out on their bluff, and they didn't even do it. And that was that was funny though, but yeah, I'm not saying for you to come down here. That's on you. I said if you're actually about this life and you're actually about this, then come down here and show it to me. But you're not, so yeah. I'm not saying oh you got to come down here. I'm not saying that. I'm saying that like if you want to prove yourself, then come down here. Come down here and we'll we'll sell this shit. But you, on the other hand, are trying to make it out to be like, oh, I'm trying to make you do that. No, I'm I'm trying to sell this shit so it can all die down because I'm sick and tired of this fucking back and forth bullshit. And I want to end it. I do. Any way I can. Any way I can. But we cannot do it over, o over online because we tried that once. It didn't fucking work. Because they wanted to break their own fucking contract. And they wanted to contradict everything that they said on there. And then, you know, etc, cetera, etc. Cetera. I even made a song about it. I think it was called... Uh, yeah, I made a song about it actually recently. I, I forgot what, what, name it, what the name of it is. But yeah, I made a song about it encapsulating what actually went down. So yeah, if you guys want to hear it, you, you guys can. It'll, it'll, be, it'll be in my video somewhere. Um, but yeah. So... Yeah, the only way I can see us selling this is in real life. But I'm not trying to tell you to come down here. That's on you. If you want to, if you want to come down here and sell this, that's on you. Um, but I'm not trying to make you go down here. So don't be trying to twist my words around saying, "Oh, he's trying to make me go down here. He's trying to make me do this." No, I'm not trying to make you do anything. That's on you. If you want to come down here and sell this shit, then let's sell this shit. Let's put it. Let's let's sell it. Let's put it behind us. Let's move the fuck on, cause. That's what you got to do in life. You got to move on. You can't fucking hold on to the past and let it let it consume you like it has cuz the past is literally consuming this person right now from the inside out. And it's sad to see. And I'll be praying for him. I'll be praying for him because that's all I can really do for these people is just pray for them and hope that God actually uh helps them out cuz they do need help. They do need help. And this person seriously needs help cuz he's got some mental issues going on. Um, and then a firearm on top of that too, uh, mentally unstable person plus a firearm usually equals tragedy. So yeah, um, hopefully nothing like that happens, but yeah, it is what it is, but yeah, it is what it is. Let's get back into it though. I'm not going down to that motherfucker because it's a waste of my time. I got a job to hold down. on. And I don't expect you to come down here. I don't even expect you because <laughs> yeah. That was just me trying to be a little bit generous, but hey, you know, you said you you said you raised your middle finger up and said fuck you, so it is what it is, you know. Um, but yeah, that's why that's why I try to be generous to everybody, even even if people hate me and want to spit in my face and all this other shit. I try to be generous to them because I am a generous person and I want to give people another chance to prove themselves. And you you held up your middle finger and said fuck you, so. It is what it is, you know. I'm moving on with my life, so I suggest you move on with yours. And you say I got a job? Great. 
great. Go go work at your job. Go get money. Go, you know, get yourself a house or whatever. I don't care. I'm down here doing my own thing. I'm down here doing my own thing, not paying attention to what you guys are doing because I really don't give two shits what you're doing. But mentioning my name and saying, oh, you're going to do this and do this and do this, um, that shit's got to stop because... That's not going to help you. It's only going to hurt you even more down the road. Um, because you're basically letting all this anger and all this hatred fester inside of you. Um, and once you guys let this hatred and let all this, all this stuff that's manifesting, once you guys let that shit go, then we can start talking about ending this shit. But until that day comes, you guys are going to stay like this for... Who knows how long? Could be two years, could be five months, who knows? Um, but yeah, this is what happens when you let hate and all this, all these other emotions fester within you for a certain amount of years, and then it comes out like this. Then it comes out like this, and then you got these idiots like this that come out and uh, do 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 idiotic idiotic shit like you know flash guns and and, and, and videos and all this other shit that's being promoted nowadays and. That is very prominent nowadays. So, yeah, I hope this person actually gets the mental help that he needs because he definitely needs, you know, a little bit of rehab. So, yeah, hopefully he gets the help he needs. But, yeah, until then, he's going to be the same person. So, yeah, it is what it is. Hey, at least I'm giving out pretty good advice, right? At least I'm not here, you know, getting down on him being like, oh, you should have never did this. Oh, you never should have did this. No, I'm giving out advice because I'm a nice person. I'm a generous person. Um, and I want to show you guys my genuineness a little bit more, like, you know, or not my genuineness, but my, uh, generosity more. So that way you guys can actually see that, hey, this person is generous. He's actually reaching out to these people and trying to help their lives instead of ruin them. Cause I mean, I could, I could, I could say, you know, fuck this person. They can do whatever the fuck they want to do, but no, I'm not doing that. I'm giving actual fucking advice in this video, and that's why I'm making this video. That's my whole point of making this video. I'm not here to tear people down. I'm not here to talk down on them. I'm here to help people, to let them see their reflection in the mirror, basically. Cause they can't see it for whatever reason. Their their vision is clouded. Um. Probably from all the drugs, probably from all this other uh, gang-affiliated shit that they're with, probably. Um, it's clouded their minds, and I'm just trying to lift the veil and show themselves who they are. And they need to realize that this is not who they are. They are actual people that have actual lives, and they need to start living them th those lives instead of sitting online, uh, you know... Trying to say, oh, oh, scene's gonna get me. Oh, Ryan's gonna get me. He's gonna do this. He's gonna do this to me if I if I don't do this. Or you know, um, being all fucking paranoid and shit. Cause that is literally making everybody, including myself, look at you and be like, oh yeah, you're a fucking loser, dude. And that's what you are. By doing this video and 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 saying the shit that you just said on here, it's making everybody, including me, look at you as a fucking loser. And then you get mad at us for saying that you're a loser because, yeah. You're the one that's showing that to us. So don't get mad at us for trying to show you who you truly are. Instead of this fake ass gangster persona that you have created for yourself. That you have yourself trapped into. This is not who you are. This is not who you are. I hope this person gets their help that they need. Because they need help. They do need help. Majorly. Majorly. I hope that day comes sooner than later. Because yeah. Like I said, mental illness and a gun, they don't go hand in hand very well. I can say that right now. Like people have the people that have mental illnesses and they purchase guns and shit, they it doesn't end very well for them. It doesn't. <laughs> Just saying that right now. We here. I got actual real world shit I'm dealing with. You? You ain't got nothing, man. Um actually that's not true. That's not true. I actually have a life outside of YouTube that a lot of people don't even see. Because when I'm not behind this camera, I'm spending time with my family. Um, what else? You know. Yeah, I'm spending time with my family, going out to eat, um, going to different places. Like when I did that video for uh, the coast trip and everything. Like, that was a fun trip. So I'm actually out doing shit. 
instead of sitting here all the time on the internet. And yes, it does seem like I am on the internet all the time, but when I'm not doing videos, I'm actually spending time with my family and making memories that will last forever because, yeah, you only get one lifetime. And you only get one lifetime to make up memories with your family. So I suggest you do the same thing. I suggest you do the same thing as well. I suggest whenever you have time off in your job, go 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 spend time with your family. Go chill with your family. Go do all that. Instead of sitting on here rambling about me over and over and over again about how I'm doing this and this and this. Like, who fucking cares what I'm doing? I don't. I'm sitting here just doing what I do best. And that's make music. Do reaction videos. That's what I do. That's what I do best in life. That's what I do. I harness that and I put it on my channel. And a lot of people hate me for that. And I honestly don't fucking care, dude. Because those people that hate on me are just, you know, they're demonically possessed. Um, and I'm going to I'm gonna get back into that a little bit more in this video. You guys will see. But I want to finish this video, so let's get back into it. But, yeah, I just thought I'd say that because I do have a life outside of YouTube. So, yeah, that narrative fucking shattered <laughs> um i i don't know if i could put a shattered glass effect but um that'd be cool if i could but yeah um that shattered that narrative <laughs> if anything else you're the joke of hip-hop right now uh, and you can ask all my little friends all 10 of them is that implying something i'm not a joke of anything if anything you're a fucking joke because he literally <laughs> Dude, you literally said you ran from the cops going 130 miles per hour. And then you're and then you have the audacity to sit here and say I'm a fucking joke? Dude. <laughs> I at least I got a clean record. At least I got a clean record. I don't I I've never gotten involved in any of that shit. But you but your ass, you probably got fucking parking tickets, you probably got a bunch of fucking uh, you know, you know fucking court shit you gotta deal with. I don't gotta deal with any of that shit because I know to stay the fuck away from that shit. And yet these people are so fucking stupid that they want to get involved in that shit. So, yeah. Hey, at least I'm not going to court like you are, so. That's one thing under my belt. <laughs> fucking don't have to go to court and shit, so. Yeah. I mean, you know, have, have fun have fun going to court and doing all this other shit that you're doing, because yeah, that's what you're doing. If anything else, you're the joke of hip hop right now. And you can ask all my little friends, all 10 of them. So, yeah. Oh, and just in case you ain't know what these are, Ryan, if you ever decide to try and come down here and start shit, this is a 40 caliber bullet. This shit'll leave a big ass hole in your fucking ass, nigga. Don't even try me. I'm not even going to. Because going up there in your shithole of a fucking town is not even in my fucking interest at all. <laughs> I don't even go... The only time I ever went that far or even close to that direction was when I went to that Post Malone concert um, here a while back. Which I have fun too, so... Yeah, and like I said, I got I got things I do outside of YouTube, so... Yeah. Another thing to shatter that narrative, but... Yeah. I don't have interest in going to your shitty ass little fucking town up in Washington or wherever the fuck it is. Um, I really don't have interest in doing that. So, yeah, you don't got to worry about me going up there and causing anything. Um, yeah, because it's not in my interest and I'm not even worried about what the fuck you're doing. So you're just making this video out of paranoia. This is literally paranoia setting in for you right now. So, yeah, I mean, let, let it let it fester. Let it fester if you want to. Um, only you can control that, um, but yeah, I'm hoping that this person does get help that they need because they do need help, so whether they want to admit it or not, they need help, so yeah. I'm tired of people sitting here making idle threats, you know what I'm saying, saying this and that, you know, I don't give a fuck. I haven't even made a single idle threat to you, what the fuck are you talking about, dude? Called you out because you were talking all that gangster shit saying you were going to fucking shoot me up and do all this other shit. But, yeah, I was only calling you out because you were saying all that shit. But, yeah, I'm not here trying to make threats to you. I'm just saying that what you're doing is ruining your life. And it is. It is ruining your life to the fullest. If you can't see it, then 
obviously your vision has been clouded. So, I mean, hey, at least I at least I'm trying to hold the mirror up to show you your own reflection. So, yeah, at least I'm trying to do that. At least I'm trying to do that. At least I'm trying to do some good in my life. So that's good. I'll put a hole in your motherfucking ass if you come up here. <laughs> and I and I ain't pulling around no damn BB gun either. I'm trying to act like Billy Badass. That's something you would do. But things been quiet this whole time. I've been keeping things quiet. Because right now, I'm working on other shit. I'm working on other music shit. Okay? God, I ain't got all day to be fucking with you all day. You know? Yeah, you, had, you still had the audacity to come up on this video and say you're gonna fucking... Yeah. This is the gangster shit that I was literally telling... Dude, this is why I called your ass out. Because you were acting like this fucking big badass with the gun and doing all this other shit when you're not even that at all. Dude, I talked to this motherfucker before. I know his personality. I know his personality, and he's not like this. He's trying to act like he's a fucking gangster, but he's not. And everybody that's watched this video can see. Yeah, we can see through your fucking persona that you're trying to portray yourself as. Like, everybody can see it. Everybody can see it, including me, including everybody else watching this video. Everybody can see that. And I'm just trying to hold the mirror up and show you your true self. That way you can snap out of this fucking, uh, whatever the fuck you're on. I don't even know, dude. You probably, he's probably on drugs. Who knows? That's how people talk when they're on drugs. They all get fucking high and mighty about themselves and this is what happens. You know, you get a fucking idiot flashing guns on, on, on a video and all this other shit. Um, and if anything, he's making out threats to me saying, oh, oh, I'm going to shoot you with this. I'm going to shoot you with, you know, these 22s or whatever, like. If that ain't fucking threat, then I don't know what is. But honestly, I don't care, dude. I've gotten hundreds of threat death threats before. So I'm honestly, I don't even care at this point. So yeah, I mean, I wish a motherfucker would. But yeah, these death threats really don't mean shit to me at, at the end of the day. Because it's all just online. So yeah, and I'm sick and tired of this online shit. But hey, it is what it is. But yeah, that's why I distance myself from this type of shit. Um, and I'm only and I'm only making this video for informational purposes only. Um, I'm not here, like I said, I'm not here to degrade or or do any of that other shit that people are probably gonna try to accuse me of. I'm not here to do that. I'm here to just give advice and uh, give my advice on everything that's going on right now. So that's what I'm trying to do. That's what I'm trying to do. So you do what you do. I do what I do. Whatever. I just wanted to make this little PA announcement here. Let you guys know. So everyone's like, oh, shit's going to happen. Shit's going to happen. Oh, they, they, fuck that, man. Let it happen. That's all I say. I got my American rights. So fucking first, first, third, fourth, and fifth amendments, man. I'm keeping my amendment right here. This is my amendment. Glock 22, nigga. What's up? I think that's the end of it. Is that the end of it? Yeah, that's the end of it. Oh my god, dude. Both of those videos are pretty long. <laughs> but yeah. Anyway, I'm going to switch back to my camera. And I'll let you guys know why I showed you guys these videos. So, yeah. I'll show you guys the broader picture of it. Um, But yeah. I'm going to be praying for that person too. I'm going to be praying for that person too. Because, yeah, he's fighting demons right now too. So, yeah. It's obvious in these videos. It's obvious in these videos. Um, But yeah. Anyway, I'll see you guys when I'm on my camera, so, um, yeah, this won't take very long. Alright, so, yeah, those videos I showed you were pretty long. I'm gonna try to edit them a little bit down a little bit, um, because, yeah, they were pretty long, they are pretty long, and I'm getting tired as fuck, but, yeah, I wanted to show you guys those videos mainly because, uh, yeah, there's a verse that I actually read last night and I actually reposted it on my community tab on my YouTube channel um and this and this is what it says this is what it says I'm gonna show you guys once I read it um but I'm gonna read it on my phone right now it says for our struggle is not against flesh and blood but against the rulers against the authorities against the powers of this dark world and against the spiritual forces of evil and the heavenly and the heavenly realms Ephesians 6 12 
It's a Bible verse. And these people that are going after me saying all this other shit, um, it's not them. It's not the actual person. It's the evil force behind them that's saying all this because they see the good in me and they want to tear me down and make me just like them to bring me on their level because that's what the, that's how the devil works the devil likes to bring you down to his level because he sees he sees that you're doing good and that you know you're reading the bible and everything and then he tries to get you to go down to his level and i'm not doing that i'm not you know thugging around shooting up people doing all this other shit um i don't do that i don't do that i don't do that i'm just a fucking youtuber a video gamer a reactionist um i wear many hats um and you guys have seen me, you know, do all that shit. And, uh, yeah, that's why I call myself, uh, seeing crazy because, um, I've seen a lot of crazy shit through my life and yeah, it's a lot, it's a lot of crazy shit. So yeah, um, that's mainly why I'm called seeing crazy. So the people are wondering why I call myself seeing crazy, but yeah. And I'm just a content creator. That's all I really am by the end of the day. So I'm not this, I'm not trying to be a gangster. I'm not trying to be all this other shit that these other people are trying to be. Um, and uh, yeah, I pray for all these people that I showed you guys in this video. I pray that they find themselves and they actually uh, do something productive with their lives instead of sitting around thinking about me all the time because that's only going to hurt them. That's only going to hurt them more than it hurts me. That's, that, that's all I'm going to say. Um, but yeah, they're only going to hurt themselves even further. Uh, the more they talk about me and the more they try to slander my name and all this other shit and try to bury me. Um, yeah, the best of ban the best on Bandlab try to bury me didn't work for them. So it's not going to work for you guys. So yeah, just thought I'd put that out there. Um, but yeah, I just thought I would go ahead and let you guys know what what's going on. Um, but yeah, it is what it is. It is what it is. I'm not trying to. I'm not trying to. Uh, I'm not trying to bring these people down either. I'm. I'm just trying to uh, show them the truth and basically hold up a mirror and show them who they really are. Cause they are living in fairy tale land while I'm here, actually living my life and doing what I what I do. Um, you know, going to the coast, going to the fucking uh, Post Malone concert, going to the E40 concert. I went to a motherfucking E40 concert, and these motherfuckers haven't. All they did was sit behind a fucking computer talking shit about me. And that's all they'll ever fucking do. While I'm out here going to concerts, going to the coast, spending time with my family, um, you know, uh, not on YouTube. Because you guys don't see most of my uh, IRL life um, outside of YouTube. But I do have a life outside of YouTube. For those that for those that want to know, I do. Um, and that coast trip proves it. So, yeah. I go on trips with my family and do all this other stuff. So, yeah, and I have fun doing it. I have fun doing it. I have fun spending time with it because, yeah, I'd be, I be making memories. And these people be sitting on here not making memories. These people be sitting on here letting hate and all this other shit fester inside of them. And letting these evil forces take control of them instead of actually taking control of their lives like they should be doing. Um, but, yeah, that's basically what's going on with them. Uh, so, yeah, like I said, I'm going to read this one more time for those in the back that didn't hear it. Um, I'm going to read it one more time. For our struggle is not against flesh and blood, but against the rulers, against the authorities, against the powers of this dark world, and against the spiritual forces of evil in the heavenly realms. Ephesians 6, 12. That's the fucking verse, dude. I'm not fighting against flesh and blood. I'm fighting against evil forces against me. And that's, and that's how I've been. Ever since I started this channel... I've been fighting with nothing but dark forces, dark energy that festers and manifests into these people that try to go after me. That's basically how it is. I just broke it down for y'all. Um, and there probably will be more. There probably will be more. Um, but yeah, as long as I got God on my side, I'll be fine. And that's how it is. That's how it is. But yeah, anyway, hope y'all enjoyed this video. Um, I know it's going to be a long video, but yeah, I had to, I had to get this out for y'all, so... Yeah, anyway, hope y'all enjoyed the video. Dish your motherfucking sing crazy sign now. I'll see you guys on the next video. And uh, yeah, peace and love. Nothing but peace and love. Um, see you guys in the next video. Peace out, everybody. I'll have some more reaction videos and some more music coming out here very soon. So stay tuned for all that. And uh, yeah, take care of yourselves. Stay prayed up. Um, God bless. Have a nice night or day or whatever, whatever, whatever uh, time zone you're in. Um, have a blessed day. And uh, yeah, um, God be with you.